even though it has been very disjointed, very chaotic, very all over the place, but I guess that has been a theme for this year, for now. Well, at least it's clean. Good morning and welcome to the studio vlog for week eight. Oh dear. Bloop. Uh, it's already 11. Uh, the studio vlog for week seven is out. I've had one comment and it's a spam comment. Woohoo! <laughs> Oi! Yeah, it's a bit weird. Um, I kind of had an epiphany last week. I had an idea for a video. Like, I feel like this is a typical feeling or not experience, but idea that I had the thought of creating just my my general most basic watercolor tips. But then again, that has been done to death. There's all sorts of how to's on the basic watercolor tips and tricks. But I think it's kind of the same thing with creating a YouTube channel or creating an Instagram to, to share your art or anything like that. It's basically, yeah, everyone else has been doing it, but maybe my way of doing it or my way of explaining it is what just one other person out there needs for it to, I don't know, register? So I'm, I, I thought about doing a my general watercolor tips and tricks. Um, and I actually started to, to write out all the tips I do have, where I got the ideas for them, how I'm doing them. Just sort of start creating the backbone of a video script. And I got really into it. So yeah, I want to do that. I, I think I may just need to put time aside to flesh out the idea more and actually write a proper script. I may, I kind of want to do normal videos, normal art videos. Just because others had the idea doesn't mean I can't do my take on them. Like there's a reason that you don't only see one three marker challenge or one <laughs> basic insert medium here tip. I should be allowed to do that, right? Anyway, that was a tangent. This is Monday. I finished off. Um, I've just written to the client about some ideas we're getting into and we now have a more concrete deadline. So that's really nice. Uh, I had to write that up on the uh, up on the um, calendar so I can see it at all times and into my bujo, so it's staring me right in the face constantly. I feel so fluffy. Also, like my earrings, I made them myself. Yeah, also um, kind of want to do more DIY stuff on the channel, really, like showing how I I do these and showing how. I make jewelry, jewelry, rule, and maybe use some of the other craft supplies I have laying around. Just have more fun with it. As in, I don't think that the channel has to be specifically documenting. So that's exciting. <laughs> My desk is a mess right now. Well, kind of a mess, so. We're just going to take it up elsewhere. I realized that I haven't opened the, uh, the story time package yet. So let's do that. Very exciting. I can already see it slightly wobbling, but that's fine. Okay, it's, it's exciting. Last pin. And... Ooh, okay, fairly, fairly. It has a bit of wobbling on the backside, but that's fine. 
It's not concave. Well, not completely anyway. I, th I think that's a win. There's a little floof on there. This is where it is at right now. So it's just time to, uh, to pull out the um, coloring pencils and get defining on it. I think, do I want to... I want to use a backing card just to keep it kind of straight. Let's do that. I mean, it has the uh, the margins for it, so. So, did you have a good weekend? I've had a lovely weekend. Not much happening, as per usual. <laughs> so, it's all strapped in and ready for coloring pencils. Clickety click. Cheap binder clips makes clicking noises. I guess that's that. The weather is amazing. The sun is out. And I am so incredibly tired. You can't believe it. But it's also getting really cold because all the windows are open. I've been trying to force myself to start the coloring pencil layer on, uh, on story time. And it's really not going as well as I want it to. And I don't know, maybe I should just stop focusing on the characters and do more of the grass and foliage layer. Right now I'm just laying around. It's not really a nap per se, but chicken and awake nap. <laughs> but as said, it's getting cold, so... I'm probably just gonna get up and close the windows, get some more water, then keep drawing in five minutes. Five minutes. So guess what I just found out? I've been signing the last two paintings I've made with the wrong year. No, the last one painting, except for the story time painting. So Aquarius is made in uh, 2021. Froggy Fishing Trip is made in 2021. Storytime is also made in 2021. But apparently Pisces was made last year. <clears throat> I have to correct that. Preferably without everything falling over. Okay, what color did I actually use? I think it was this one. So, <laughs> okay, there we go. There we go. No one suspects a thing. <clears throat> I'm sorry about the sound. It's the upstairs neighbor. Should be over soon-ish. But this also means that story time is finished. I think it turned out really good. Well, it could be a lot better, but that is not for my skill level right now. I forgot the bird. Let's just quickly finish up the bird. Cross our fingers. I don't fuck it up completely. That's all right. At least now it, it kind of feels like it's on the same plane of existence as everyone else. So this is how it's ended up. And I'm going to go ahead and um, scan it. Make some um, test prints. And see how well it works. I'm going to cross my fingers that it's going to work out okay. Uh and then that I'm not going to cry if it turns out it's not. I promised myself I wouldn't start crying if it went wrong. It's very hard, but I'm not crying. What the fuck is this shit? Ugh. Epson. Epson. Epson? So, uh... Remember when I told you not to color manage my print? 
How is this not color managing? How is this not color managing? Can you tell me that, Epson? Can you tell me? I was supposed to talk about what I did yesterday, how my day went, um, anything I got made or finished or anything. I'm, I'm slowly realizing I do have a few things I could talk about, but it's mostly just nothing. Barely anything went down yesterday. <laughs> I had a creative corner ish skype meeting with the friend again and i think i got started with a pokemon themed illustration she got this really cool idea about a i guess bicycle basket it's called i really want to commemorate the 25 year anniversary of uh, of the first pokemon games coming out this saturday but I also didn't want to just do the three main characters, not main characters, starters again this year, because I already did that last year. But yeah, she had a really cute idea about a Pokemon in a bicycle basket, and that ended up being a really cute um, correlation to to some of the first episodes from the anime as well. I'm not going to put in a Pikachu, but I am going to put in an Eevee. God, I hope I'm going to be finished with all of that. I don't know. My mind is a mess right now. After I stop drawing in the sketchbook, I'm doing uh, some client work. Uh, before I started to talk, or trying to talk, I just sat here staring into the distance <laughs> for a good while because I, I don't really feel like I have anything to share. Nothing is happening. It's just the same old my mind is a mess and my mood is a pool of mud. <laughs> and I really don't want these studio vlogs to be the... D is feeling down in the dumps again. Diaries. So, I don't know. I also don't really want to hide it. Because, what's the good in that? So maybe just have a mention of it being a couple of off days and then doing something else. I think this is basically just lighting. Hey, Thursday came around, somehow. Uh, I've been working a bunch on uh, on the cover art for the, um, the podcast for a client. And it's really coming together. I'm quite excited about this. I've made two versions that I'm going to send off to her. And, yeah, I guess we'll see what comes of it. Um, do have a few. I'm still tweaking a few things, but I think we might actually be, um, be where, where it's supposed to be. I'm gonna have to ask whether or not it's okay for me to show off this before uh, the premiere. And if not, I guess you're gonna see it when the podcast comes out, which is also very fine. I don't know, I don't have a lot other things to say about it, it's just... It's really coming together, and I'm very excited to hear what the client says. 
this stage of everything is that I can keep on tweaking and and keep on working it, but but yeah, no, I, I think I just have to send it off and see what the client says and get on with my life for a little while. Instead of sitting here and tweaking, I also have to be very mindful about the client's time. Like whenever I'm experimenting, I haven't actually timed the process just because it doesn't feel right to make the client pay for me experimenting. I'm not talking about making different iterations and experimenting in the sense of what looks good together and how can we make this come together for for the client. I'm thinking more like things I'm not personally tried before, so I don't know whether they work or not at all in general. And I th that I don't think it's proper to make the client pay for. Anyway, I think I have a a strong um, um, direction of where what I'm gonna send off. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. All right, so there we go. We've sent off the I've sent off the uh, the ideas for the client, and now I'm not gonna look at it for a little while. It's nearly lunch time. I have to. Important thing I have to do today is tell the tax people about my taxes. <laughs> uh, so I guess I'm just gonna go ahead and do that because. Um, what else? I still have the uh, Pokemon illustration I want to make for Saturday. I have a few days left for that. Um, I may... I don't know how to make it yet. I'm probably not going to make a watercolor. But it has been quite a while since last time I made something in Marcus, so... I don't know. I really don't know yet. Good thing I have a lot of time while doing tax stuff to think about that. So, yay. Should I make it digital? No, because I only have two days left to, to, to do this. Might be a really bad idea to play around with a medium I have. I don't really know how to use for that. Am I panicking? No, but I'm hungry and I need to pee and I have a hard time figuring out what to do next. Not because I don't have a lot of stuff I could do, but because it, it just feels like this cloud of to do stuff and I have I have to sit down and figure out what is what. And yeah, gotta do that. I also didn't get around to make a, a normal art video this week, this month, sorry. Words are weird. Look at me. I am the queen of fluff. Okay, it's it's not as bad as it was earlier. But still, but still. Uh, it's Friday and I am nowhere near where I wanted to be by today. But that's fine. Cover is uh, is in the final stages. So that's that. And... Tomorrow is the Pokemon day, and this is kind of what I have. Uh, so, yeah, I don't know, It um, that's supposed to be a pitchy. And 
person on the bike and the little Eevee. I was actually wondering though if I should just go with a small cute picture, like just having Eevee in there. Uh, basket type thing. I know that might be cute. Maybe with some flowers. Something like that. Just super simple. I don't know. Something cute. That might actually be uh, be a bad idea. Not that I don't I really want to do this this one with Evie in the bicycle and the trainer riding along and yeah the Pidgey flying around maybe some uh, some Rattata running along with the bike something like that it just seems um yeah I have to manage my <laughs> my expectations when it comes to what I can and can't get done today because it has to be finished today Preferably within the next fuck within the next hour, which is not gonna happen, but kind of have to be done very soon. So as I said, I don't have a lot of time for it, and I think this might be a better idea. It's gonna be really cute, I think. A quick sketch later, and oh my god, look how cute that is! That is adorable. I need I need to create this. <laughs> Look at it, it's so cute. get a proper mic for the phone. One that doesn't go crunchy 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 if I move if I move the phone.
If I move the thaw around, <laughs> I can't talk. But look at this wonderful, beautiful weather. It's amazing. It's Monday at 3 in the afternoon. I'm tired. I'm in a bad mood. I'm... I don't know. Uh, I'm far behind on, uh, on the studio vlog that has to go up. Well, had to go up at 10. Slept in because I couldn't get myself up. Ended up writhing in pain. I don't know why. I guess because I've been laying in bed all day. Suppose so. Tea. So I'm basically just here to end off the vlog and put a punctuation mark on the, on the final edit. Then I'm probably gonna upload it, I guess, even though it has been very disjointed, very chaotic, very all over the place, but I guess that has been a theme for this year, for now. I don't really know if I'm gonna go ahead and uh, and film this week. Might not, probably. I don't know, time will tell. But for now I'll just end the studio vlog for, for last week and see if I can make a plan for today and for tomorrow, for the coming weeks. I guess that's gonna be it. If you got this far in the video, I guess thank you, because wow, chaos, um, chaos and stuff falling apart and oh god, I think I might just need a break from um, from everything at the moment. So, yeah, don't expect another studio vlog next week, but um, if it comes out, it comes out. If it doesn't, it doesn't, and that's fine. Thank you anyway. Thank you for watching, and take care. Bye.